4-H'ers took their animals to the auction block tonight. Storm Team 10's Brady Harp spoke with one 4-H'er. He joins us now in the studio with more on what he says he's learned through his experience. Yeah, kids I spoke to say they work all year for this auction. They say the event at the Vigo County Fair is a way to earn back some of the money on their investment in the animals. 4-H'ers sold their animals at the livestock auction Friday. Participants say the event is what they work towards all year. Very important to the kids because they do, they work so hard. Every one of these kids works so hard to get to this point, to have an animal in the auction, and it's a really big deal for them just to be in that auction. Along with teaching 4-H'ers about properly raising animals and working toward a goal, the auction provides them with money to help them out with their higher education. Still good to get some of that money back, but all the money that we make from this goes into my college fund. And I think that's as well as all the, a lot of the other kids, and so it just helps the kids in the future. Many might get attached to their furry friends before selling them, but 4-H'ers like Lance Fagan say this is all part of the experience. And you have to remember that you are working toward this. You're raising your pig to sell it, so you, you do get attached to him, but you have to keep in your head as soon as you get that pig or whatever you're selling in the auction, you have to remember that you're working toward one goal, and that's to raise meat for other people. Participants say over 100 animals were sold tonight at the auction. Back to you.